What a weekend of great football. In the NFC, we have the Saints versus the Vikings for the NFC Championship. In the AFC, the Colts will be hosting the New York Jets next weekend. The winner of each game will face each other in Miami in the Super Bowl. The Jets upset both the San Diego Chargers yesterday and handed the Colts back up to the team's first defeat of the season. Will the Colts regret giving the Jets life in the playoffs, or will the Colts take care of business and have a second Super Bowl berth in Miami? It was just like the regular season when the Ravens ran a lot but couldn't muster a touchdown against the Colts. But this was more impressive. A 20-3 thumping in Saturday's AFC Divisional Playoff game at Lucas Oil Stadium. Remember how Pro Bowl running back Ray Rice went on the road and ran through the New England Patriots for a franchise playoff record 159 yards rushing last Sunday? He had 67 yards against the Colts. He averaged 5.2 yards per carry, but didn't go off like the week before. The Ravens as a team managed 87 yards on 19 carries, a decent 4.6 yard average against the NFL's 24th ranked rushing defense, but they couldn't count on it. For a month, the Colts played it safe, nearly too safe, calling off the dogs in the second half of that fateful loss to the New York Jets. They not only risked the loss of all their momentum, but they risked incurring the wrath of fans still stung by the decision. Lose this one, and it wasn't going to be pretty. Three weeks ago, the Indianapolis Colts declined an opportunity to eliminate the New York Jets from the playoff. They cost themselves a shot at perfection in the process, so here it comes. Either the Indianapolis Colts' ultimate dream or their worst nightmare. Here come the New York Jets, America's Cinderella and Indy's Frankenstein. The Jets are the Colts' creation, a team that only reached the playoffs because Colts president Bill Pullion and coach Jim Caldwell were not interested in perfection. Now this imposing monster of a team, bolstered by a frightful defense and the enduring power of belief, is coming to Lucas Oil Stadium for Sunday's AFC Championship game. Go Colts!